Blessings TLC and oh my goodness, we have reached number 40 of our 40 Monday fast. I'm just so proud of everyone. I'm just so blessed and the testimonies and the things that people have said to me. I mean, we've had children that have been fasting for breakthrough. We've had people who say, look, I don't normally fast, but I have been compelled to fast. And we've had tremendous breakthroughs and I'm sure that we're gonna have a program where we just have some testimonies come through of the fast that we've done. So well done, TLC. Now today, we are going to fast. We're gonna fast and it's our 40th day, so it's gotta be something where we really push home. Now, I don't know about you, but sometimes in my life, you know, it's, it's nice and it's calm and you know, it's great. But then other times, oh my goodness, it feels like a war zone. You know, it feels like, you know, things are just exploding everywhere and just, you know, kind of, you know, it, it, the things are kicking off and it feels like, you know, every corner you turn, you're getting shot at, you know? You're just getting shot at and there are darts and there are arrows and explosions and my goodness, it just feels like life turns into a war zone. But you know, most of those things are just a distraction. They're just an illusion that the enemy creates to try and distract you from your real destiny. So as we go into fast number 40, I want to be clear about what we're fasting for. We are fasting to, listen, step into destiny. Now, when I talk about stepping into destiny, I'm talking about lifting off into your destiny. Now, the best example I can think of is, can you imagine an aeroplane that is just moving on the runway, just taxiing on the runway? Two minutes, five minutes. After half an hour, the thing is still just running around on, on the runway. After some time, the passengers are going to say, well, what's wrong? what's wrong with the pilot? Is the pilot dead or something? Why is the plane not taking off? Because you know that, you know, if, if I just wanted to taxi around, I could have just, you know, got a coach or, or a car. But I'm in an aeroplane. I'm in an aeroplane because I expect to be in the air. I'm, I'm in an aeroplane because I expect to lift off. And this is what I'm saying to you. This is what your destiny is like. You didn't just get saved just to taxi around like the Israelites for 40 years, just to roam around talking about what could be and talking about what God could do in your life. You are a born again child of God because the Bible says you are meant to mount up with wings as eagles. You should be airborne by now. And when I talk about stepping into your destiny, I'm talking about fasting for a life changing event, a life ch changing stepping over. Now, to give an example, look at Moses. You know, Moses was there looking after sheep for 40 years and then suddenly a burning bush experience where he had an encounter with God and after that he was never the same. He stepped into something different that day. Jesus was a carpenter and he was there working for 30 years but then all of a sudden he got baptized by John the Baptist and the Bible says the heavens opened and after that he was driven into the wilderness to go and fast but when he came out the Bible says he came out in the power of the Holy Spirit and just began to heal the sick and began to preach this radical message that got people is saved and, and intimate with God. So I could go on and on about events that changed history. Look at Esther, you know, when she met with the king that changed her life, you know, you, you, you know, and, and you could think about Joseph, you know, that, you know, up until then he had had some success, but when he interpreted Pharaoh's dream, that was a game changer. Child of God, I believe that you need a game changer. I believe that there is some event in your life and because we've fasted for 40 Mondays, you are within your right to approach God, approach the throne room. He invites you to come boldly to his throne room and begin to pray and begin to fast for a life changing event, something that causes you to step into your destiny, something that causes you to have lift off, no longer taxiing around on the, on the runway. But when people see you, they understand, now this guy, this woman has changed. Something has changed in their life. You know, they may have been on the A roads, but they're on the motorway now. And I believe that this next fast is going to fast track you into your destiny. So TLC, listen, thank you so much for your faithfulness and your diligence of fasting. We can do this when we do this together. God bless you and stay blessed.